Hello and welcome to Kismet Rising. Today we are doing a meditation which helps you to move beyond procrastination. So if you are finding yourself blocked in some kind of way, if you'd really like to be able to reach a goal uh, or to just simply change your situation and stop procrastinating and actually just be able to get down to something, then this is the meditation for you. So the way in which we're going to do this is um, we're going to come to a space where we are grounded and we are going to focus on the goal that you need to take yourself to through. And along that way, we're going to look at what is standing on our way and we're going to work through that. So in a way, this is also a meditation about overcoming blockages, about being able to reach your goals, but ultimately it is tailored for those who are currently procrastinating and who need to find an immediate solution. So if you are one of those people that are browsing through YouTube at the moment and or you're on my website and you've come across this meditation and you want to overcome procrastination, then get let's just get right into it. Okay, so uh, the first thing I'd like for you to do is to seat yourself comfortably and to be able to, uh, if you're wearing shoes, then to remove them, uh, if possible, if you're in a place where you can remove them, and simply to uh, be free. So seat yourself comfortably or lay down and close your eyes. So once you've seated yourself comfortably, or you are lying down comfortably, feel your body, feel all of your body. You may start at your toes, at the tips of your toes, and feel every inch of your body as you move through your feet, up your ankles, along your calves, to your knees, along your thighs, up to your hips, through your abdomen, up to your breast cavity, up to your shoulders, then your neck and your head and go through to the top of your head. You may pause this if you need to, or simply take your time to be able to move through your body and cover every inch of yourself. This exercise will help you to come back to yourself. This is a grounding exercise and it helps you to bring yourself back into you. Now that you have taken the time to bring yourself back into you, take a moment to feel what it feels like to be present in your body with all of your being. As you do this exercise, you may feel a bit agitated or a bit anxious or as if your mind is wanting to run away. You might want to go faster. You might feel bored. Simply observe these thoughts as they pass through your mind and return back to your body. Simply observe the emotions that come to the fore and let it go and 
return back to your body. See yourself encapsulated within your body, a complete package in perfection with itself. As you feel your wholeness and your being and the comfort of yourself. Accept the state of your being. As you do so, you may experience a feeling of gratitude. Embrace this feeling. If you do not have a feeling of gratitude, Do not force it, simply accept yourself as you are within the state of your being. Continue to bring yourself back to this moment and to this moment and to this moment. until nothing else exists outside of you, but that all of you, including your consciousness, your mind, your thoughts, are all within the capsule of your body, within your being, all is one. Now, as you sit there or lie there and feel this oneness that you possess in you, take a moment to remember and then to focus on your goal. Visualize in your mind's eye with your eyes closed exactly how you see the completed project or where you see yourself. See it in a visualization that is finite. It must have a beginning and an end or simply a picture of where you see yourself when you have completed your task, when you have succeeded, when you have overcome your hurdles, when you are finished. Observe this visualization Note your posture. Note what you're wearing. What it feels like to be in that state. Note what it smells like. Note what the temperature is. Note whether you feel a breeze or if the air is still. If you are visualizing a picture, animate that picture. You do not need to make it a moving picture. Simply animate it and feel and breathe into you what it feels like to have arrived at that goal.
feel the satisfaction. Feel the peace intermingled with joy and with delight. The delight that you experience once you have reached your goal and once you have successfully completed it. If you have not yet completed your visualization, take a moment now to complete your picture. Remember to have a finite picture to see the beginning and the end, the left to the right or the right to the left and the top to the bottom and the bottom to the top. You know exactly what this picture looks like and you know exactly what it feels like to be in that position. Take a moment to soak in that feeling of success and accomplishment. Now, draw a line between yourself and your visualization. So if you see this picture before you, draw a line between yourself and that picture along which you could walk or float, a path which you can follow to get to that place which you have just visualized. If you have difficulty in visualizing this path or in creating this path, simply draw a line between yourself and your visualization with a piece of white chalk. If you are still having difficulties and you are unable to draw a line, simply see the path ahead of you that leads you to your final destination, the goal that you have taken a moment to visualize, the end product. Now, feel what it feels like to walk along that path, to get directly to your goal. Is the path visible? Can you simply walk to your goal? Is the path a clear path? Do you experience any hurdles or any obstacles along the way? Is it a dark path and you cannot find your way? Or do you find yourself in a maze and you don't know how to extract yourself from it? Or do you see yourself in a thicket and you don't know how to get through it? 
whatever you see at this moment, simply take a moment to observe it and to recognize that this is simply a hurdle that can be overcome. If you have no such hurdles and you've drawn a perfect line between yourself and your goal and you are making your way to it now as we speak without resistance, then savor the moment. Savor the journey that you are taking Feel how light it is and how easy it is and how you're making yourself move ahead with prowess, with strength and fortitude. Feel the strength that comes from within you and from beneath you that propels you forward towards your dream, your goal, and that which you have visualized. Simply make your way to your visualization, and when you find yourself inside your picture, then take a moment to breathe in the success and the feeling of that manifestation, the accomplishment and the success. For those of you who are struggling to make their way and who cannot find their way along, have you noticed what is it Have you observed what is it that is in your way? Where does this fear come from? What makes you want to avoid it? What makes you want to turn around and run in the other direction? What is so daunting? Simply observe it. Do not engage in an emotion if an emotion comes to the fore. If a feeling comes to the fore, simply observe it, acknowledge it, and then release it. These feelings, these fears, these obstacles that lay before you, whether it be simply a thought process, a thought pattern, a poor routine, or an external uh, obstacle such as a person or an institution that's creating a blockage, these are all things that can be removed. Ask yourself, are you ready to clear the path? How would you feel at this moment if we were to clear the path that lies between you and your end goal? Take a moment to feel what that feels like. Once again, do not engage in the emotion. Simply observe, acknowledge and release. Now, 
I want you to stand at the precipice of your path and I want you to clear your path now you may engage the help of whichever divine helpers are standing by to assist you in mowing down whatever obstacles lie before you If it is a thicket you see, then visualize it opening up so that a path, a clean, clear path is created before you so that you may simply make your way towards your goal. If it is a rushing, raging river that lies before you and that is your obstacle, See a bridge being built over that water that takes you directly to your visualization, to your goal. See yourself on your path as it miraculously opens up ahead of you as you make your way towards your goal. If they are people or institutions or other bureaucratic obstacles that lie in your way, see it, step aside and make way for you to reach your goal. If it is your own fears that assemble themselves as monsters before you, Visualize them also parting to make way for you to be able to reach your goal. If it is a maze that you find yourself in, you are guided through the maze to find yourself at the foot of your goal. Recognize that you have been procrastinating or you have been unable to do what you need to do because you are afraid and your fear has paralyzed you. Recognize that your fear is within your control and as your ego has conjured up the fear in order to protect you in some way, you are able to open up your path to be able to reach your goal and place your ego on pause. Recognize the power and the strength that you have to be able to open up your path simply with your visualization, with a laser-like concentration, burning your path ahead, creating a clear and clean path that is easy to walk through, which brings you to your goal in harmony in ease so that you may delight and you may breathe and taste the success that feeling of accomplishment that end goal that you want so desperately to reach You are now reunited with your end product, your goal, what you have previously visualized. You have come through your path of obstacles. You have been brave and you have been guided. You have been supported along the way and you are reunited in the future 
with where it is that you are headed. Take a moment to feel this union. Take a moment to appreciate where you are at. And take a moment to appreciate how far you have come and what you have had to go through in order to get here. If you feel you need to hold hands with yourself in the future, show your support to yourself in the future, show yourself in the future that you are there for you regardless of what lay before you. Show your loyalty to yourself and be one with you. As the distance between you in the future and you as you lay or as you sit at your space collapses, bring that visualization of the future into your body and into your being and let it seal once again. For within you, in your heart, lies your goals and your dreams fully accomplished in the future. And there's nothing for you to do now, but simply to walk your path, knowing that the obstacles will part their way. It's simply needed for you to trust that and to understand that you simply need to forge ahead. Do not hesitate. Go forth now. Create your schedule or your plan and begin working towards your goals. If you have already begun, simply continue and do not stop until you've reached where you want to be. Take a moment to feel snug with yourself and with your visualization inside of you as you lay down. Slowly begin to feel all of your being as you bring yourself back down. Feel all that you can of your body beginning at the top of your head, working your way down your head through your face along your neck and your shoulders and your arms and your hands, along your breast cavity, into your abdomen, along the hips, the genitals, into your thighs, your knees, your calves, your ankles, your feet, your toes and the tips of your toes and you are brought back to this moment. And as you come back to this moment, take a moment to feel where you are right now, to feel the surface upon which you are seated or lying. And when you feel ready, you may open your eyes.
this meditation has now ended. I thank you for joining me today. I apologize for any flaws in this meditation. It was a channeled meditation and it was infused with healing. And I hope that you will have gotten the essence of it and that it assists you in going ahead and allowing you to overcome your procrastination if you have been procrastinating or simply allowing you to get to your goals with more clarity, with more focus and with a sense of empowerment. I send you all much love and much blessings. Blessings abound from Kismet Rising and much success to you all.